and flavors of Italy reveals itself well in the word Avante. In English, it means to come in, welcome to all. And Avante Trattoria welcomes all to downtown Oshawa. It's a family tradition with an Italian flair. Their specialty, wood oven pizzas, salads, and of course, pasta. It's a nice casual atmosphere, uh, wood tables, a lot of the decor uh, makes you feel like you're actually in Italy. Uh, a lot of the pictures that are up on the, uh, on the walls and stuff were actually taken um, in Italy. Uh, most of them were from my parents' 25th wedding anniversary. Uh, a lot of the pictures, and they're actually blown up into uh, portrait size. Uh, just to give you that uh, feel, a lot of the wines and things like that are uh, Italian, the olive oils, the balsamic that you have on the tables, we try to keep it as casual. That's why we don't have stem glasses, uh, they're stemless glasses, so you kind of get that casual feel to it. Uh, as well as we don't have linens on the table, uh, they're hardwood, and the napkins are paper just to give you that nice, cool atmosphere where you, know, you don't have that stuckiness. When you think of Italian cuisine, you think pasta. So Nick, what are you making there? Tonight we're making the penne con polo. Penne con polo. What does compolo mean? Uh, polo is Italian for chicken. Oh, okay, polo yeah. is Italian for chicken. Perfect. Okay. And already you have in there butter, onions, no. garlic. Extra virgin olive oil. Okay. Onions, garlic. Great, then and what's next? We're going to add some mushrooms. Some mushrooms. Okay. Some grilled chicken. Grilled chicken. More. Sun-dried tomatoes. Some sun-dried. And what flavor is that going to give it to? It uh, adds a sweetness to it, actually. Sweetness to it, okay. Yeah. okay. We're just going to return it. Okay. Saute the onions to bring out and garlic and mushrooms to bring out the flavors. Okay. And, we, and this isn't the main sauce yet? No, this is just the base ingredients. Okay. Now we're going to deglaze the pan with white wine. Okay, with white wine. Woo! Nice sizzling. Oh, and the flame. Yep, just let that reduce down. And Looks that, good. what does the wine do to it? It helps get all those nice little flavor bits off the bottom of the pan and adds additional flavors. Adds additional Water. flavors to it. Perfect. Well, I can't wait till we add the pasta in. We get to try it after. Top three pastas that we have would be the penne con polo, which is uh, penne done with a cream sauce, julienne of chicken, uh, sun-dried tomatoes, which is a fantastic dish. Uh, second, I would probably say, would be the tagliatelle with the goat cheese, which is uh, tagliatelle pasta, roasted red pepper cream sauce, uh, artichokes with uh, goat cheese on top. Uh, third would be the spaghetti with meatballs, which the meatballs are actually uh, handmade from my mother, actually, her secret recipe that she has. We actually have fresh herbs that we use in a lot of our dishes here. Here we have uh, fresh basil, and we have Sicilian basil, as well as mint, some rosemary, and parsley that we use in our dishes. You use all of these in your dishes? Yes, we do. Fresh herbs. Well, if that isn't fresh, I don't know what is. There's a lot of uh, places that have wood oven pizzas. Um, ours actually works with three. It actually uses wood, gas, and electric. Uh, the wood actually brings it up to 700 degrees uh, and actually uses it for flavoring. The gas keeps it at a constant temperature and actually our pizzas cook in about three to four minutes. Today we're gonna to be making the vegetarian, one of our most popular sellers. Okay, vegetarian, so good for veggie lovers out there. Sauce is your first step, spread it out nice and evenly. And you put it on pretty thin? Yeah, nice and thin. Not too overpowering, but we still don't know yet what the secret is. It's okay, I'll figure it out later. And now we're going for the cheese and it's mozzarella? Yes, this is mozzarella okay. cheese. I put a light amount on the, on light, the vegetarian. You don't want anything too much on it. Okay. okay. Arugula? Arugula. What kind of flavor would that be on there? This is like a, a peppery, spicy, peppery, spicy lettuce. So not just a, a usual vegetarian, you're spicing up a little? Yep. Tomatoes. Okay. Green pepper. Green peppers. And then I'll let you finish it off. Awesome. With these four ingredients here. Just spread them out. Yep. Mushrooms. Okay. Oh, got a couple of onions in there. It's okay. Oh, it's a perfect. Onions. Perfect. And I'm just gonna put a bit of broccoli and and some black know, olives. And some black olives. All right. Now I'm gonna let you do the magic. Throw it right into the wood oven here. This one here. Perfect. And that is how it's done. A 
Avanti has that authentic feel of eating at a trattoria in the heart of Italy. And then there's the food. From wood oven pizzas to salads and popular pasta dishes, the menu here is perfect for anyone who's ready to experience the love of Italian cuisine. Avanti Trattoria is located at 17 King Street East in Oshawa.